I'm Anil Kumar, sharing with you an excellent question from my subscriber. So let me thank her for posting this question. And I hope many of my viewers will definitely benefit from its solution. We are looking into logarithmic functions inequality. We need to solve ln x whole square minus ln x to the power of 4 plus 3 greater than or equal to 0. Now, in logarithmic functions, when we say ln x, we mean x should be greater than 0. So, that is the restriction of our solution. Now, uh, we could rewrite this inequality as ln x whole square minus 4 ln x plus 3 greater than equal to 0. Now, in this particular case, treat it as a quadratic equation, right? So let's factor product of 3, sum of minus 4. So we could write this as ln x minus, so 3 times 1, right, will give you uh, minus 3. So we could write this as minus 3x, I mean minus 3 ln x minus ln x plus 3 greater than or equal to 0. Whole square, right? Okay. So let's factor ln x. So we get ln x and we have ln x minus 3. Here, if I take minus common, we get ln x minus 3 greater than or equal to 0. Now ln x minus 3 is common. And the other factor is ln x minus 1, greater than or equal to 0. So that basically gives us the solution. We could treat this as kind of a parabola. So we could make table of values and can also do. But the easier way here is to think about uh, the, the parabola as such. So it should look like something like uh, like this, right? Where the two zeros are at ln x equals to 3. So one zero is at ln x equals to 3, right? And the other at ln x equals to 1. If ln x is equal to 3, then x is equal to e to the power of 3. And if ln x equals to 1, then x is equal to e to the power of 1, which is e, right? So, so we have two zeros here, which are at e and e cube. We want this function to be greater. And we also know that the the function is only valid for values which are on the right side of 0, right? So basically, we do get a solution which is from 0 to e and beyond e cube. Does it make sense, right? So that is how we can actually solve this particular question. So finally, we can write down our answer, which is x is greater than 0, but less than e, union, x is greater than e cube. Does make sense? So that becomes the solution for our question. So I hope that is absolutely clear. Feel free to write your comments and share your views. And if you like and subscribe to my videos, it would be great. Thanks for watching and all the best.